white nail polish, ten toes down. Look back at it, shawty, don't look sit down. Tattoo, he can do the see through. Yeah. Body clean the color, I see you. I see you. We are finna do this, okay? It's the first day of this little challenge, and yeah, good morning. Welcome back to my channel if you already subscribed. If you're not subscribed, welcome to my channel. Go ahead and subscribe while you're here. There are certain things that I want to add into my routine, and there are certain things that I just want to start doing that requires me to wake up earlier. And I knew that me waking up earlier was going to take some real dedication, so I was like, you know what? I'm going to sit here and not plan it out, but I'm going to have to be real intentional about whenever I start waking up early. So it's finally the week that I decided that I'm going to try and wake up at 4 a.m. I'm waking up at 4 a.m. because that's what works better for my schedule. So um, the gym that I have a subscription at, they have workout classes at 5 a.m., 6 a.m., um, 6 p.m. And it works best for my schedule to go at 5 a.m. My morning routine starts at 6 a.m. So if I go at 5 a.m. workout, by the time I get back home, I can just go roll into my normal morning routine. And I personally am one of those people who like to work out early in the morning because I just like to get it done and out the way. I literally went to bed late last night. I went to bed probably around 10.30 ish because um i just got back home i had a lot of things i needed to do i actually just closed out a video last night so if i look familiar that's why but yeah so um i just had a lot to do but i actually feel pretty well rested uh, at least I made it for day one. I honestly feel like I'm going to be able to do this with no problem. I think the biggest thing for me is going to be going to bed early the day before. I really need to go to bed between 8 and 9 if I really want to do this and be consistent and have like a decent amount of rest. Um, I really do feel like me going to bed on time is going to be the biggest factor in this. But yeah, we made it through day one. Um, it is 4.06. Um, Novi is obviously still asleep. And I'm so glad y'all. Um, the whole reason I'm even able to do this video is because the owner of the gym that I go to, she was so nice and she said I could bring it over to the classes so this is also gonna be my first time bringing over to the class um i hope that that goes well because the whole concept of this morning routine rides on that but i'm really hoping that this morning routine works for us if it does then this is just what i have to stick to waking up at 4 a.m is crazy but i feel like if i want to become consistent in the gym and be to work on time let's get into that that's another reason why i want to wake up earlier i'm hoping that because i already have like a head start on my day that i can be to work on time so we're gonna see if my theory works hopefully i'm able to do that and you know be to work on time every day this week i feel like i should be able to the plan for this week is to wake up at four um i have between four o'clock to four thirty to do something productive so today i have to um make up my bed because i was washing my um bedding so i'm gonna make up my bed but then at 4.30, I'm going to leave to go to the gym. And then at 5 o'clock, I will have my workout. Now, the workout, length of the workout kind of varies on who the instructor is and what day it is and stuff. And then from 6 to 7.35 will be my normal morning routine. So that is going to be my morning routine, hopefully, for the week. That's my idea. I'm honestly, this is just like a try and error, like an experiment type of thing. We're just going to see what works best for us. But let's go ahead and make up this bed. And then I'm going to go ahead and put my gym clothes on. So when it's just me and you alone, you're lonely, you're alone, but it's lonely when you know me, yeah, gotta take, you can take me to a place where you can be, I'm alone, I let you hold me, cause you know Okay, I made it my bed. So my stuff is still a little damp, so I'm gonna run my heater while I go to the gym. But I found what I'm gonna wear today. So I'm gonna wear this two-piece set from Target. These both are from All In Motion. This is like the little track jacket. And then um, these are the pants. I got the jacket in extra small. I guess I really want to get BBL. And then I think I'm gonna put on either my Prestos or my Vapor Max with this. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and get dressed, crank up the car, brush my teeth, and um, head to the gym. I'm really not gonna do too much Shinobi because I don't really get her ready until seven. And she's literally just gonna be hopefully sleeping in her stroller um while i work out so i'm not gonna do nothing but put a jacket on top of her and a blanket and 
yeah, call it a day. But yeah, I'm about to go ahead and get dressed. And I didn't tell y'all what kind of workout we're doing today. It's called Move It Monday. This is my first time doing this workout at this gym because different days they have different workouts. So yeah, this one is called Move It Monday. It's a boot camp style workout with cardio resistance and strength training. And it lasts for 45 minutes. So I'll be out of there right on time. It says boot camp style, so I'm kind of intimidated by that. But even the most intense workouts that I've had there still haven't been so much to where I feel like I'm straining my body. So I feel like I should be good. I did work out there on Saturday and I still, I feel like a little sore but it's not like how it usually is and i really feel like that's because we stretch before and after we work out so i feel like i should be fine but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and get ready and then i'll meet y'all at the gym Put that on my own, on my hood, on my hood. I look fly, I look good. You can't touch my back, but you could. I look fly, I look too good. Put that on my own, on my hood, on my hood. I look fly, I look good. You can't touch my back, but you could. I look fly, I look too good. So obviously I'm back home. Um, I made it from the workout. Um, I was really scared about that workout. Um, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Like we did a lot of um, arm stuff, which I don't really like working on my arms because I feel like they look way too muscular. But it definitely did start to burn. But I didn't like sweat a lot, which is a good thing. Like I like to sweat because I feel like I know I'm getting a good workout when I sweat. But at the same time, like if I ain't got to sweat, then maybe I'm not gonna sweat. So. That was a good little workout. Novi, I was like, okay, you know what? It's four o'clock in the morning or five o'clock in the morning. Novi's gonna be asleep. She's not even gonna be up, baby. Almost as soon as we got in there, she woke up. And I was like, oh, she's gonna go back to sleep because she's used to hearing like live music and stuff and it don't bother her. Maybe she stayed up the whole entire class. Whole entire class, um, I did put on like Gracie and Rachel and she was chill in the beginning and then she just started talking and babbling and laughing. And then by the end of the class, she was like trying to get out her shoulder. So I was like, I've ha I was having to put her on my lap. She wasn't as bad as like running around the gym but I wish that she was quiet and I felt so bad I was like you know what I'm gonna send her a text I'm gonna be like listen if I can't bring her anymore I completely understand and when I was leaving she was like oh she was so good I was like really I thought she was too loud and I was like no she was fine I was like really she didn't distract y'all because I swear to god I felt so bad but she said it was cool I was thinking about next time I bring Nova I'm gonna put some earmuffs on her because she got some for when we go to the track so I think I'm gonna put those on her I think maybe the music is what woke her up and that way she won't hear the music and she couldn't stay asleep because I don't have time. Like, I literally had to keep stopping to turn on the phone or skip the ad or just to put her back in the stroller. Like, I just need to be asleep. I'm going to try to put them earmuffs on her and feed her before we go. And then hopefully she'll be a lot more um, quiet and peaceful and just you know, won't even know that she's there. But yeah, um, I don't know. I think my mama said she's off tomorrow. So my mom's off tomorrow. I might just leave Novi here with her. I gotta see first, but yeah. um, First day completed, workout was good. I might go ahead and take a shower. I'm actually running a little behind because I meant to be home at six and I didn't get home until 6.15. So I kind of got to hurry now. I gotta take a shower, get dressed. I'll probably shower after I'm dressed because like I said, I'm running behind. And if I talk to y'all, I'm gonna be even more behind. So I'll just show y'all. i either show y'all when I get dressed or once I get Nova ready. And then when we finna head out. All right, y'all, so obviously I got dressed for work um it's currently 7 37 and i told y'all when i'm on time i typically leave at like 7 35 i can still leave at 7 40 and still be on time but um i'm headed out the door at a decent time today so i should be to work on time we'll see um me and Novi are dressed though she actually took a nap i woke her up when i got her dressed but she was sleeping because she's tired because she was up since like five in the morning See, yeah i'm tired she i'm so tired <laughs> um but yeah so I'm finna go to work, drop her off at her daddy's house. Um, I'll probably check in with y'all afterwards to let y'all know if I made it there on time. I was thinking about taking a nap. We'll see how I feel. I don't feel like taking a nap is cheating. I feel like that's gonna help me get through the day, especially since it's the first day. So yeah, I might take a nap today. We'll see. But um, yeah, I'm gonna check in with y'all after work. I just want to show y'all that we heading out the house and we making it out at a decent time, even to say that I got back late. So 
yeah i would say we starting off on the right foot all right y'all i literally just got off of work and baby i'm tired after i took my lunch break I, and it could be the food i'm not gonna lie because i do get really sleepy after I, um i eat but baby after i took my lunch break mm -mm, i was like yeah no Mm -mm. I'm about to go to my boyfriend's house. I'm about to go take a nap. I could go back home, but every time that I have to go back to work, I end up just staying at his house. So I don't have to drive home and then go back out unless I just have something to do at home. So I'm just gonna go to my boyfriend's house, take a nap, and hopefully I have enough energy to finish the day. I really just to like miss my body, like kind of getting used to it. But hopefully by like Wednesday, um, I'll be kind of used to it and I have enough energy to get through the day. I could have drunk another um, cup of coffee, but I didn't. I still drunk like the same amount of coffee. I just think I gotta get used to it. It, but I definitely was tired today like I was so tired y'all but made it through the work day without falling asleep so I'm gonna take this nap and that should get me through the rest of my day um I'll probably give y'all update when I get back home um when I get off work for good but I just wanted to give y'all a little update because I definitely was tired today all right y'all let's do a little debrief situation because baby things got very hectic okay so I told y'all you know I was getting off work and I was pretty short they ain't pulling my hair I was like um I'm getting off work and I'm pretty short I'm gonna end up taking a nap um Novi actually had not taken her second nap of the day either because her sleep schedule is also messed up and um we end up taking a nap together mind you the meeting that i had to go to was at six o'clock so i took a nap i probably went to sleep around 4 30 ish and i was like you know i'm not gonna set an alarm there's no way that i'm gonna sleep for like over an hour and a half i wake up it's like 5 50 something and i have to be to meeting at six um and so i'm like still yeah, trying to wake up but trying to get ready to go to the meeting um i ended up getting there a little bit late and i just feel like so my head hurt because I haven't eaten in a while. I think that's why it hurts at least, but I have like a headache and I was just super anxious and feeling super tired like and drowsy. Just not feeling like myself, y'all. I did not expect to go through this because like I did. I woke up at 4 a.m. one morning and I was fine. It wasn't like that big of a deal, but I think it's the fact that I had a board meeting to go to today that made it just super challenging because it's like that takes up a lot of energy and I think I'm just really like depleted and I really should be going to bed early tonight, but I'm like, you know what, baby? Had to wash her. Got to eat dinner. And I want to go ahead and finish editing a video because I want to go out tomorrow. And I just want to have it done before I go to work tomorrow. So um, I'm going to go ahead and finish editing that video tonight. It's almost 9 o'clock. So probably by the time I'm done finishing, it'll be like right at 10 o'clock. And I ended up going to bed last night um, at like 10.30ish. So I'm hoping that the extra 30 minutes will give me the oomph that I need because I do not want to feel like I felt today, tomorrow um but yeah so novi is not gonna come with me into the gym tomorrow because i think my mom um should be able to watch her when i go but i am still gonna go to the gym tomorrow morning yeah i just wanted to give y'all an update because i don't know why i was like oh this is gonna be easy like this is nothing but as the day progressed it got so much harder like i could feel myself having such low energy which i barely be feeling like that like i'd be tired but this was a different type of tired okay so definitely tomorrow i want to go to bed early and i think i have something else to do for work wednesday night i think so i might have another late night wednesday but i definitely want to try to go to bed as early as possible because that's gonna be the key to me being successful at waking up at 4 a.m like i can do it but as far as like it being healthy and me feeling um energized i'm gonna need to go to bed at a decent time but yeah so i'm gonna check in with y'all um Probably one of my food gets out of the air fryer. I'm just doing some little Trader Joe's chicken poppers because I feel like I'm not that hungry, but I know I need to eat. And I just want something that I can snack on while I'm editing. So, yeah. I'm also finishing. I don't know what I do with it, but I got a smoothie from Smoothie King yesterday. So, I'm also finishing that. But, yeah. Your girl is very much tired, but I'm just determined to push through. And I'm hoping that tomorrow is a lot more smooth. Because, like I said, I can just get off. And if I want to take a three-hour nap, I can do that. Because I won't have nowhere to go after work tomorrow. So, yeah. But today, today drained me. Today drained me me like today really drained me like for real it drained me like i said tomorrow should be better fingers crossed okay still i can feel your energy someday your dna obey Y'all can tell on my face, baby, that I'm tired. Oh, God, you're not supposed to wake up, baby. <laughs> Come on, let's go back to sleep. Mm -hmm. oh, you're so sweet. You're so sweet. Come on. That light bothering you. I didn't go back to sleep. I didn't go back to sleep. I almost did. I really wanted to, but I knew that if I would have like 
lay down without my phone, I was going back to sleep. So I just, you know, was on my phone looking at my emails, looking at YouTube, um, but I didn't go back to sleep. I might go ahead and put on my clothes because I did kind of want to get to my workout class a little early today. Um, my mama is here, so I'm going to leave Novi with her, so that way I don't have to worry about taking her and everything like that, but um, yeah. I don't know what I want to put on, though. Like, why am I trying to be so cute for workout class? I don't know, but I am, so I don't know what to put on. I have a bunch of different leggings that I'm thinking about wearing. If I just wear some leggings, I can wear one of these with like my little workout um, half zips. And then I have this set that I could wear too, but I just really don't know what I'm going to wear. But yeah, so I'm going to get dressed really fast and then um, go to class. I'm literally just going to brush my teeth. I'm not going to do nothing to my hair. I think my edges, they still good from yesterday actually. But yeah, so I'm about to just get dressed right fast. And then I'll probably see y'all at the workout class. Today's hip hop cardio. This is my first time doing this class. So um, I'm excited because I love hip hop. I love cardio. So I feel like this would be probably one of my favorite workouts. Yesterday definitely had my arms burning, but I can tell like... Because we're stretching, I'm not sore. Like, when I used to work out by myself, I was only stretching, like, before the workout, pretty much. So, I'd be super, super sore. But I can tell that, like, because I have somebody there to tell me how to do workouts and how to have the proper form, and because we're stretching before and after, I'm not as sore. Like, I might feel a little pain if I'm doing a certain move, but not really. So, that's good. But I really thought these workout classes are going to help me be consistent waking up because <laughs> otherwise, baby, I'd go back to sleep because I don't have no reason to be up. But I have something to do, and that's, like, an obligation, like, I'm really good at being disciplined when other people are depending on me or when other people are involved. If it's just me, myself, and I, baby, I'm... Unfortunately, I'm not going to show up for myself like that. But because I have this class and it's like, oh, I pay money and somebody's expecting to see me there, it's like, keep me more disciplined. So, yeah, I'm about to get dressed. I might show you my outfit before I go. And then we're going to head to class. <laughs> Zero to a hundred nigga real quick They be on that rap to pay the bill shit And I don't feel that shit Not even a little bit Oh lord, know yourself, know your worth nigga My actions being louder than my words nigga How you so high but still so down to earth nigga Niggas wanna do it, we can do it on they turf nigga Oh lord, I'm the rookie in the vet Shout out to the bitches I ain't holding down the set All up in my phone looking at pictures from the other night She gon' be upset if she keeps scrolling to the left Alright y'all um, obviously I'm back from workouts. <sighs> a quick update. Workout was good. Um, definitely sweated and a little bit more intense than yesterday, but this was a cardio class. I can definitely feel the burn today and like my legs are on fire. Some of the times when we was doing moves, I couldn't even like do it to my full potential because my legs was hurting so bad. So I'm already knowing I'm probably sore tomorrow, but it was a good workout. It was a nice, quick and easy workout. 30 minutes and I got home on time, so I definitely should be to work on time today. I need to go get my bonnet. What am I doing? But yeah, so I'm about to take a shower right fast. I'll probably see y'all um, whenever I'm getting ready or something. It's so funny, like my alarm, my normal alarm for 6 a.m. keep going off. But it's like, baby, I done been up for two hours at this point. Like, I don't need you anymore. But um, yeah, so I might take a shower and then I'll probably see y'all whenever I get out. Okay, I think this angle is cute. As y'all can tell, I done got a shower, got dressed. I'm finna do my skincare right now and I'm finna take this scarf off because it's making my head hurt. I low-key think I need to start eating breakfast if I'm gonna be up so early because I don't know, like I'm never a breakfast person, but I feel like that's part of the reason why yesterday I felt so like tired and everything because I didn't eat breakfast. So I don't know if I have time or even food to make breakfast here today, but I might go grocery shopping so I can get some breakfast stuff. But yeah, so I might do my skincare right quick. But yeah, so I do feel a little bit better because I don't know if y'all can tell, but I just feel very sluggish today. Like and low energy versus yesterday I was like very high energy like come on let's do this and today I'm just like all right let's do this you know like just not feeling as much but i feel a little bit better now that i took a shower and been up for a little bit i think i'm gonna make me a matcha before i go to work because i y'all when i tell y'all i don't know how me adding something into my morning routine has made me like has made my morning routine shorter but somehow it has like literally i don't be done getting ready until like 7 15 and what time is it it's 6 51 and i'm almost done getting ready like that's crazy so whole 15 minutes early so yeah i think i'm gonna make me a matcha before i go to work just so i can have something to sip on i need to start using aquaphor or something because i feel like everything is breaking me out like y'all see these bumps up here i never get acne so i hate that i'm having acne but it is what it is but anywho at the workout class today i noticed that they had a um whatchamacallit like on the mirror they have everybody's names and they have like tally marks and i've seen it but i didn't know like what it was for but i kind of should have figured but anywho um, i might add my name up there today and i put two because we are two in and basically she said it's like not a competition but like a challenge so whoever gets the most um 
tallies for a month they get something so she was like this month it'll be a t-shirt and she said next month she's thinking about doing like a free month of classes so i think that's a good thing she says really for accountability but also you know if you want the prize that can also kind of help you um stay motivated or whatever so your girl added my name up there and i felt so good like mm, like not me being consistent not two days in the gym check me out i'm excited to see what's gonna come from me being like consistent in the gym because i have never really been consistent like long term like the most consistent i probably have been is like a month so i feel like if i really like stick to this routine i can get like really really consistent and um, be a gym girly oh boy this is gonna be i just know this is gonna be a long week i just know it what are we doing for scent today so i'm gonna do i'm gonna mix these two up kind of give like a warm musky scent baby it's not going nowhere your neck is completely covered that's good because i know my neck breaking out i have no sleeves because um it's like in the 70s this week it got so hot yesterday and i'm loving it because baby i am a summer girly like summer me please my birthday is at the end of summer but it's still summer because i'm a summer baby all this winter crap not for me so i'm dressed i'm ready I'm trying to debate if i should go ahead and make my matcha first or should i get an overdress first i'm gonna do my matcha first because if i get her dress then she's gonna be up and then i'm gonna attend her so i'm not gonna be able to join my matcha so i'm gonna go ahead and make my matcha now and i can just sip it on the way to work so let's go make my matcha all right y'all so i just made my matcha i'm glad i tasted it first because i was really about to talk trash and be like I don't know if I like Trader Joe's matcha. That's good. Especially compared to the last one I bought. I like that. Okay, Trader Joe's. I see you. I got a few more minutes. Well, literally two minutes before um I wake up Nova. But I'm about to order some stuff on Amazon. Because I need a bunch of like tech stuff. I lost both of the mics that I had. So I need to order a new mic for my camera. Because I was reviewing my... It literally just finished. I was reviewing a video that I filmed. And some of the parts like you couldn't really hear me talking like that. So I want to get another mic. And then I want to get another camera case. Because the one that I ordered didn't fit. And I'm thinking about getting um a new ipad and mac case as well because i actually did get my mac back um my old old mac i got that fixed so i want to get um a case or i really want to sleep for that and i'm thinking about getting an ipad case so yeah i'm about to order that stuff i also need to get a car tripod too so i'm doing a little amazon order yeah, amazon give me deals and stuff they know i want i need to put some lotion on my hands i do need an ipad stand too because that will help me so much when i'm editing bro so much yeah i think i'm gonna get an ipad stand too while i'm at it i'm about to order this stuff but yeah i'm gonna see y'all later As y'all can tell, it's 4 in the morning and I am wide awake. I actually woke up at 3.30 to use the bathroom and kind of never went back to sleep. I tried to lay back down, but I couldn't fall back asleep. So yeah, I've been up for about 30 minutes at this point. Um, I didn't really come back and talk to y'all yesterday, but I didn't even end up taking a nap yesterday. And surprisingly, I feel more energized. So I don't know if I'm gonna take a nap today or not. But yeah, I did go to bed a little bit earlier um, yesterday. I don't know what time I went to bed, but I know I was too bad by 10 o'clock, probably more like 9 o'clock, 9.30. So I did get more sleep. Even though I didn't take a nap, I went to bed earlier. So I think that kind of helped a lot too. But yeah, so I'm out to clean up the house because I literally went to sleep on Nova Anze and Nova just made a mess. So I'm out to clean up after her and then I'm going to go ahead and get ready for the gym. What is today's class? I forgot what today's class is called. Dose of Kayla. So she says it's going to be a dose of Katie today, but um, I've never been to this workout class. A lot of these classes I haven't been to because I was only going to classes on certain days and every day they have a uh, different workout. Out. but yeah that's what we're gonna be doing today i really don't know what to expect but i'm gonna go ahead and try and clean up right fast before i get ready for the gym and um head out so let's clean up i literally gotta clean up the kitchen her playroom my room and that should be everything but she made a little mess To say I woke up a little earlier, even though I didn't like get up, I thought that the morning would go a lot smoother, but baby, this has been a chaotic morning. All right, y'all. So yeah, like I said, this morning has been a little chaotic just because I love so many things last night like i didn't watch no v last night i didn't do um what put up the laundry last night um like i said she made a bunch of messes that i had to clean up her playroom was actually clean i thought for sure she probably demolished it but she didn't even go in her playroom so i didn't have to clean that up but i seen i had put up the laundry that was in my room she has some laundry that's in her room too so i probably put that up when i get back um and i cleaned up the den um i gotta finish cleaning up my room like the clutter and then making up the bed and everything when we get back but yeah this morning has been a lot and then i change her every morning anyways but like she pooped so i had to like really really clean her 
her which i wish i could wash her but it don't really make sense to wash her now and then take her out in the cold so uh zay can just wash her but i don't know i just feel like all over the place and she's up so that's not good because i was hoping that she'd be asleep and i could just put the little not earmuffs but headphone thingies on her and she would just you know be asleep for the entire class but being that she's up now and we haven't even left yet is not a good sign. But yeah, um, I'm about to brush my teeth and then head out. I'm actually running late, but I should be fine because we don't start like exactly at 5 o'clock, so I should be fine. Um, I did want to show my outfit, so I'll show my outfit in the other bathroom and then we can head out. So I'm basically ready. I'm about to put on something on my lips just because I want to be extra. Um, but I don't clean my face, brush my teeth. I don't know why I brush my teeth. Before I go to the gym, I feel like it saves me so much more time. Like, when I come back, I feel like all I gotta do is take a shower and put on my clothes. Like, I don't have to do too much to get ready. But, yeah, let me show my outfit right quick. So, this entire outfit is from Finca. Um, the jacket, the leggings, the little tank top. I wore this tank top um, to a workout the other day. And it's really good. Like, it has good support. And I like it because it's, like, longer. It looks like a bra. But it's more like a crop top bra, if that makes sense. So you get, like, a little bit more coverage. And then these leggings are high-waisted. They are super duper, like, they gonna snatch you. Like, these fit my body so well. And it has, like, a little contrast stitching and everything. I really feel like I'm giving, like, girl, that like, soccer mom. But, yeah, baby. Can y'all see her? She's wide awake. So let's hope she falls asleep by the time we go to the class. You ready to go, mommy? Come on, let's go. That shit feels really, really good outside. So I'm, I'm not gonna bring her, um, a jacket. But, yeah. Let's go work out. All right, y'all. So I just got back home. Um, I didn't record workouts today because I was already running late. And then by the time I got over in the shoulder and got in there, I was like, they was already doing stretching and they was doing circuit workouts. So I was like, I'm just not even going to bother trying to film today because with circuit workouts, you know, we're going in rotation and trying to pick up my camera and move to every workout would have been a lot. And like I said, I was already running late. So I just like, you know what? I will vlog my workouts tomorrow because I was planning to not vlog my workouts tomorrow. I just vlog them tomorrow. But yeah, so we did work today was definitely like intense i we worked on our core today which is really good because that's really like the main area that i want to focus on i just want to like kind of get a flat stomach and then tone my butt and so we did a lot of core workouts and i could really feel the burn so that was good um i didn't really sweat too much i didn't even, i didn't even end up taking off my jacket but it was a really good workout and we had somebody new well not new but um well one lady typically does the workouts but i think like one or two days out the week somebody else leads them and the lady there today she was so nice y'all like no be trying to get yeah, her stroller like she like i don't be strapping her down so she be standing up in the stroller trying to crawl like or climb down the stroller and stuff and i had to keep stopping my workouts like i stopped probably like at least five times um my workouts to go to the nova and like it was annoying because like i'm trying to get the workout in but by the time i get back to the workout it was already over with and she was like do you want me to hold her and she held over for a little while and nobody like to go to nobody so i was like you know what thank you so much like that's one thing i can say like it's very rare to find a gym that's that supportive of moms like they are so freaking supportive the fact they even let me bring nova is just super nice and then the fact that she was like oh you know i can hold it like they're just so freaking nice y'all like it's called confidence for a reason like literally but i might take a shower um i'm planning to talk to y'all when i get ready so hopefully i have enough time to do that but yeah workout was good um i feel pretty good energy i feel like today i'll do better about not feeling tired so hopefully i will but i'm gonna see y'all when i get out of the shower I just got out this shower and I did wash my face. So I might go ahead with the rest of my skincare. Y'all, this little, um, let me show it to y'all. This little Fenty Skin Plush Pudding. She's good. She's good. It's still on my lips. Like, that's the type of lip gloss I need because I put it on at like before five o'clock and it's almost seven o'clock and it's still on my face so we love that for me i don't know i'd be feeling like a lot of bombs and lip glosses don't be lasting but i guess that's the difference like bombs supposed to last longer lip gloss really just supposed to be for like the look really but i think that's what it is i'd be getting glosses thinking of their bombs i was late to work yesterday but that wasn't even my fault like i was in the parking lot at the right time but literally it was like me and five other people pulled up at the same time and there was like a line to clock in so that's why I was late yesterday, but I technically was on time. Like, in spirit, I was on time because I was in the parking lot. Like, I was doing everything I was supposed to do. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was actually there 
at eight o'clock so yeah but i was late to work yesterday so i'm like determined to get to work on time today i don't know i wanted to get a lot more stuff done this morning but i don't know i just feel like i'm like running behind like i have good energy and i'm in a good mood but i just feel like i'm running behind so i don't think i have enough time to do um everything i need to do before i leave for work i don't know i just feel like i got a lot to do today like i'm supposed to be going somewhere when i get off i think and i need to finish editing a video really I want to finish editing it today because I don't want to like not have it done tomorrow and I want it to go out by the end of February so I really need to finish it today so that it can be out um, by February because I feel like if I don't finish it tonight and I'm like oh I can finish it tomorrow if it gets to be like five o'clock and it's not done it's, it's not gonna be up on time so I think I'm gonna just really lock in today but I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna lock in and go somewhere so we'll see but yeah and it's not like i can stay up i meant to stay, i'm not gonna lie i had all intentions yesterday when i came home to like come home edit and then go to sleep well eat and go to sleep but they came over so i was just in my <laughs> like i'm gonna say south girl era but i was just like when they come over baby the whole rest of the world is for me like i'm not doing nothing i'm gonna be lazy and lay up with my man and that's what exactly what i did so i think that's good though because i feel like that's why i have so much energy today because if i would have edited yesterday i probably wouldn't have had um i probably would have went to bed late and not have as much energy as i do now because i feel like me waking up early like i don't mind waking up early whatsoever but it's just the fact of like having enough sleep so that i'm not sleep deprived during the day or tired and lagging and stuff so that's just gonna be the main thing but i feel like right now my, my words because we'll see how i feel um this afternoon but i feel like right now um this seems doable like i could do this i have to figure out how i can bring over to the gym with me without it being a distraction and then i need to figure out um not even figure out what time to go to sleep because i know i need to be asleep at like nine at the latest really just figuring out how to make more maximize my time because i only have what five hours after i get off so yeah but i also organized my closet when i was putting on my laundry because a lot of my outfits fell down because it's just too packed in there i really need to do like the clutter but i'm gonna wait on that because i just know it's gonna be like a whole project but um i'm thinking about reorganizing my room and i was like oh you should do that today but i'm like i already have too much things to do today so i don't know if i'm gonna have time to do that today but maybe i will by the end of the week i don't know we'll see i might get dressed put on my work clothes and ov ironically fell asleep i got the shower i was like dang she made no noise she didn't come and see me yeah she's not down but yeah so i'm finna get dressed and i'll see y'all when i'm finna head out for work or either when i get off like i said it's probably gonna be a really busy day so yeah y'all just stay tuned good morning y'all didn't wake up with an alarm today because it is 3 36 and i'm already up so i think my body's getting used to waking up early because this is now the second day in a row and i didn't even wake up to use the bathroom i just woke up early i'm gonna edit until four because i think this morning before we go to the workouts i'm gonna feed novi so hopefully she'll be like real nice and full and hopefully be asleep hopefully she'll stay asleep um you know for the whole entire workout so yeah i'm about to edit until like four or something and then i'm like be nova and then get dressed for the workouts um today is step it up thursday i've done this class a few times so i know what it like looks like for the most part um it is one of my favorite classes just like the playlists and the moves and stuff so yeah and it's like a pretty good sweat i would say i had an outfit picked out for today but i think i'm putting on something different because it got it started raining last night and it got so cold so i think i'm putting on something different but yeah i just wanted to show y'all that i'm up like really early and it's crazy because i wanted to finish editing my video last night but i was like i know i need to go to bed early if i'm awake up on time so i went to bed at like 10 o'clock so it's kind of ironic that i still woke up early but i'm gonna take it as a sign that i can do it okay i might make me a matcha this morning too i wanted me a matcha so bad yesterday morning but i didn't have enough time to make a matcha but yeah and i didn't tell y'all so i was late to work tuesday and wednesday I told y'all on tuesday yes it was wednesday right yeah yes it was wednesday yesterday i had a good reason to be late like and i knew i was gonna be late because i was doing something but i would have been on time if i wanted to be i just was doing something that was really important to me so yeah um but hopefully I can make it to work on time today. Um, I'm about to edit this video and then um, I'm going to check in with y'all probably when I'm getting ready for the workouts. And my stuff from Amazon comes today. So I'm going to show y'all that whenever it gets here. Probably like after I get off work. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to edit until I get ready and I'm going to check in with y'all. P.S. I'm going to put a picture on the screen. I woke up. Baby, my heart almost jumped out my chest. I'm like, where's my child? Why is she on the floor? I didn't move at all. I, I ain't going to say I didn't move at all. But I didn't like push her out of bed or nothing. Why is she on the floor? How did she go? 
on the floor. Oh, I fall on the floor. Now I'm hearing it. I don't know. But I was like, where's my child? I look on the floor and she's on the floor. Sleeping comfortably. I'm like, girl. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So I know this lighting is cringe, but it's like the best we're gonna get because it's literally 447. Yeah, I can't wait till daylight savings time because this is not it. But yeah, anyways, I'm on my way to the workout. Um, I'm leaving a little bit late, but not as late as I left yesterday. So I definitely should be like on time or maybe miss like the first minute or so, but I won't be as super late as I was yesterday. I wasn't even super late yesterday, maybe like five minutes, maybe five to ten minutes, but I just don't like doing that. So yeah. But I'm on my way to my workout. I don't know, y'all. I was just thinking because I told y'all I was like uh editing a video or whatever. In my last video, I was like, you know, I'm gonna be working out all next week. And it's so crazy to me because like I would say even when I'm not in shape, it's nothing for me to go to the gym. But it's crazy to me how I literally just flipped the switch. Like I went from working out maybe once every two weeks, three weeks to working out every day this week. And it's like I literally said I'm gonna work out next week and I did it. Like I literally spoke it to existence and it's just like you can really do anything you put your mind to. Like that's that's really it. Anything you put your mind to, you can do it. If you think you can do it, you can do it. Like that just goes to show like how important self-talk is and positive self-talk is and how destructive negative self-talk can be. When I was going to the gym and I would like end up stopping, it would almost always be because I would like talk to myself negatively and be like, oh well, I don't have the energy to go to the gym today or I'm not seeing the results so I'm not gonna keep going to the gym or I can't keep doing it. Like just telling myself that I can't, I can't, I can't. And of course if you tell yourself you can't, then you're not going to. But I feel like I have to be so intentional about talking to myself in a good way because if not, baby, I'm gonna fail. I'm not gonna be consistent. And don't get me wrong, I don't mean I have to go to the gym five days a week, you know, for the rest of my life. Things come up, things happen. Some days I might skip the gym, like I might just not be in a mood, but for the most part, I do want to be consistent about going to the gym at least three to four times a week at the minimum. And so the way I can't wait till my car tripod come in today because the camera has fallen like three times, but I think that me moving forward, if I talk to myself in a positive way that I can really see myself being consistent. And two, like I shouldn't just be going to the gym to look a certain way, like it's also about feeling good. And I actually really do like working out cause it's like a stress release for me. So I'm hoping that between me having like the right mindset, going into working out, like being positive and doing it for like, health reasons and not for appearance reasons i think i can really be consistent and do this thing like for real so yeah i just had to share it with y'all but yeah it was on my heart real heavy to tell y'all that this morning i don't know i just was like having a realization like i really said i'm gonna do it and i did it like here i am doing this thing and it's like i would never imagine myself to be the person waking up at 4 a.m going to the gym and then have like a whole day but i'm doing it like literally so speaking to existence anything you put your mind to you can do and have a great day we finna go get this workout in, get a little sweat in, and yeah. I'm obviously in a good mood if y'all couldn't tell, and I love that for me. I hope y'all in a good mood too. But let's get this day started. They need me to go, but I don't wanna leave. Rest in peace, a little kid. Fuck a pigeonhole, I'm a night out, this a different mode. I'ma have to make a pan of six on a pinky toe. Heard you with a shooting guard, just let a nigga know. I would have your court side, not the middle row. All good love in a minute though. I can't stress about no bitch cause I'm a timid soul. Plus I'm cooking up ambition on the kitchen stove. Pot start to bubble, see the suds, that shit good to go. Oh Sam Suave, but I can't get me cold. All right, y'all. Um, I left my camera batteries in the car and my camera is dying, so I'm gonna make this real fast. That workout, that was the best workout we had this week. Like, I am literally sweating. I'm back. I went outside in the cold with just a sports bra and leggings um, just to get another camera battery for y'all because I love y'all. But that workout was so good, y'all. I was like really, really sweating. I wanted to take on my jacket, but I felt like too exposed. Like, I don't know, I felt a little exposed. So I was like, I'm gonna keep my jacket on, but I unzipped it and baby, that workout was really, really good. Like I feel the sweat. I'm like, oh my God, I feel nasty. I need to go take a shower, but I love that feeling. Like I just love when I sweat because it's like, I feel the calories are burning. I feel it, okay? But yeah, so that was a really, really good workout. Except for, I thought today was the day. I was like, for sure, no is going to stay asleep during the workout. I was trying to be so careful getting her out of the car and it's like as soon as I take her out of the car seat to put her on her shoulder, that's when she wakes up. The transfers will wake her up. I'm wishing right now I had a doodle stroller. I'm like, 
oh my god so she was up and at first it was cool chill whatever by the end of class she was like trying to climb a stroller she was trying to do every day but today it was just on 10 like she actually was out the stroller we were doing circuit workouts and i don't know if like i got good footage for y'all today because between us doing circuit workouts which means we're moving around and it might be a different person at my spot in the next two minutes and the fact that nobody's being bad i just don't think i got pretty good footage today but we were doing circuit workouts so i like the last round i had to like bring her with me i missed like two of the uh two of the circuits or two of the workouts because i was tending to her then i brought her with me and it was just a mess it was just a mess i was like oh my god i can't do this so i don't know what arrangement i'm gonna make because 4 a.m to drop her off at 4 a.m to somebody would basically mean that she has to stay the night with them which i really don't want to do but i'm gonna have to do it because i can't do that like it's literally distracting me from my workout it's taking away from my workout i can't work out like that and i tried to like bring cherry tart juice to see if that would make her go to sleep but she wouldn't even drink it like she didn't even taste it she just looked at the cup and didn't want it so i was like uh but yeah, so workout was great. Um, I am going tomorrow morning. Um, I wasn't going to work out originally tomorrow morning because they only have 6 a.m. Um, yoga, but I'm not going to work tomorrow, so I can actually go um, do that workout. But yeah, I have like two hours before I go work out or an hour and a half before I work out instead of just 30 minutes. So that's great. But yeah, so I'm finna hop in the shower, um, wash off all this sweat and gunk, but I love it. And then I'll probably hit y'all up after. Um, I'm going to go and finish cutting my video when I get, when I finish getting ready because my mom's keeping over today, so I really don't have to do too much. So yeah, and if I have time, make me watch it too because i want another one but yeah good workout we did four days in a row waking up at 4 a.m or 3 30 so i'm being proud of myself one more day to go and i definitely do think this is something i keep up so yeah i'm happy drop the roof and let the smoke clear i got diamonds doing to see slides in both ears dice rolling on the las vegas strip tonight slip that on and we might miss the fight fuck or not i keep the quality in my shorty bag no, she want a mom when she tattooed that ass I'm a lover boy, she got the toys Keep it coming, you a rider Just that roll myself a day and count my figure shit I look greasy. I look greasy. All right, so I told y'all I was gonna try and edit um before I go to work, but literally um it's like 7:30 and I just finished making my matcha and you know getting ready and everything. So obviously I don't have time to cut the video, but I'm just gonna um do it later. And I should be to work like on time on time because I'm leaving literally at 7:35. On a good day I'll leave at 7:40. So I should be to work real early in on time today. But yeah, I did make my little matcha. It's good too. I like Trader Joe's matcha. Like I like the taste of it, but it's like it takes so much of it to like tastes like matcha if that makes sense like i don't know if i'm putting too much water and milk but like when i used to make my other matchas i would use like the same um amount and it would just be a strong matcha flavor this one i gotta use so much matcha to get the flavor but it's good i like it i like it way better than that um one that i got from the grocery store that you just like pour i like it's way better I'm finna take my matcha with me to work. I probably will see y'all when I get off because I actually don't have any plans today. And plus my Amazon packages are coming today, so I'm gonna show those when I get off too. But I just want to give y'all a little update. I'm kind of disappointed I didn't have time to edit my video, but literally y'all, I didn't get into the shower until I want to say 6.30 because I was talking to y'all and stuff. And then I just was like sitting, just letting the water run me for a while, which I probably shouldn't have did. That's kind of why I'm running behind, but it's okay. I'm gonna finish my video, fingers crossed. Hopefully y'all see it on February 29th and not March 1st. But yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna see y'all later on. Hey, babe. My lips and everything just feels so weird, y'all. But it's four. Um, it's Friday morning. Oh, baby, we officially woke up at 4 a.m. for a week. I really did this. I'm proud of myself. I'm a big part of myself. Oh my god, y'all. I'm so tired. <laughs> it's definitely given I'm gonna take another nap today. Yeah. I'm gonna need a nap today. Um, bro. <laughs> when I get back home today, I'll probably end up taking a nap for like a, at least an hour. Um, cause I told you I'm not going to work today, so I think I'm gonna take a nap because I meant to go to bed at nine, no ten, but Novi woke me up, so I probably didn't go to bed till really like eleven thirty ish. But yeah, I definitely want to take a nap because I can feel like I'm so sleep deprived because I'm not going to bed when I should be. Like I at least need to be going to bed by nine, eight ideally, but nine o'clock really at the latest. But I've been going to bed at like ten, ten thirty, eleven. So that's why I've been so sleepy. But I've been pushing through, and yesterday I didn't have a nap, so I feel like I can do it. But it's just like I want to do it healthy, right? Since like my class isn't until six today, and I'm waking up at four, I feel like it's gonna be easier for me to fall back asleep because that's the whole two hours or well, hour and a half at least that i have to like kill time and like be productive for i feel like not sick but my sinuses are acting up so bad y'all so if i'm low energy in addition to me being sleep deprived that's a lot um i ended up going back to sleep from like i want to say four 
30-ish to like 5.15. Woke up at 5.15 I was like, nah, that's not long enough. Ended up waking up at like 5.26 and then went back to sleep and woke up at like 5.38 something. So. so at this point I'm running late for the workout so I'm going to try and share my outfit real fast. Um, I have on this two-piece cotton set from Target. Um, It's just like a crop top and then some yoga pants. My A6 and then this white... um. I think this is all in motion pullover, but I really like these working out. So I just want to cotton since I'm going to be doing yoga today. I shouldn't really be sweating a lot, but I'm running late. So let's go. And then let's go ahead and find a nice forward fold. Inhale to lift your right foot off of your mat. And then let's bring that knee into our chest. Bring it a little bit closer to our nose, round through your spine. Come down on your left knee, untuck your toes. Even if you need to come all the way back up, that's an option too. Keeping your hips stacked. And then maybe we inhale to send our hand out past our head. Open your chest up a little bit more. Press into the top of your left, the left foot. One more deep inhale as we stretch. And let your exhale bring you all the way back into your tabletop. And let's go ahead and send it back to a child's pose. Allow your hips to sit on top of your feet, your chest to melt on top of your thighs. You can bring your, your head down to your mat. Just really collapse into our child's pose. Allow your hips and your thighs to come down to your mat. And let's get our elbows in line with our shoulders, palms face down. And inhale to just roll your shoulders down your back and open through your chest. Bring your gaze out. camera done so i'll make this so quick so i've been wanting to try this little coffee shop but i don't know i just never be having the time to go because i be having to go to work but since i'm not going to work today i decided i'm finally gonna try it out so i got what they call a chill latte which is basically like a frappe and i got salted caramel and toasted um marshmallow mix and then i got an everything bagel with sausage egg and cheese this looks so good i'm about to fuck this up because i haven't been having breakfast none this week and i feel like having breakfast will help me with having more energy so I know this gonna hit the spot and be really good, but yoga class was great, y'all. It was so relaxing, so soothing, so peaceful. Like, I was literally finna fall asleep in there as if I didn't already oversleep. But it was so good. I definitely think I'm gonna keep going. All right, y'all. So, I'm obviously back home. I didn't even make my bed this morning because, you yeah, know, I was running late. I was like 15 minutes late to the class. <laughs> good thing it was 45 minutes long, though. But, um, yeah. So, back home. I'm still drinking on my latte it's pretty good it's like heavy coffee flavor or that or either all the syrup is at the bottom so but she blended this so i don't think so let me see maybe i don't like the toasted marshmallow i don't know something a little off but i do think i'll go back there because like i literally always have to go to mcdonald's i was planning to go to mcdonald's today and i was like you know what? no i'm gonna try the new coffee spot but definitely gonna try and go back there because i like to like support small businesses but yeah so i low-key wish i had brought my laptop with me in there because it was like i was the only person in there i could have i could have really had a little vibe and like just got some work done and stuff but um i didn't even think to do that but that would have been a really good idea i might do that i might do that one day it probably has been a weekend though because like i said like when i be going to work i don't be having time to stop for coffee and then you know come home so yeah it was nice i was able to do that today but um yeah so i'm finally gonna open up my amazon packages so i said in my last video that i need to order a car tripod and i kept saying i was gonna do it and just never did it and then oh this is so cute she's so cute i'm screaming i'm screaming i'm screaming no i don't think you understand i'm obsessed she's so cute all right, so I ordered a bunch of stuff, y'all. Let me just get everything out of the boxes first. I'm literally screaming at how cute this piece is. Am I becoming a paint girly? Because that's what it seems like. So basically, I ordered mostly a bunch of tech stuff. Um, Did they put all my stuff in one? I ordered a bunch of stuff and I was like, oh shit, I didn't get my car shot file. So then I ordered that and I was like, oh dang, you know, I wish it was with other stuff and they still put it in there. So they must have known like, okay, we got two orders going out to her. So basically, I ordered a bunch of cases. I'm going to order a case for my iPad, my MacBook, my phone, and my camera. So let me get a phone case too. I just wanted to switch it up. And literally everything I got was pink. I was going to get, um, well, I got the cake, my phone case first. And it's pink. But when I was trying to find a camera case, literally I could not find any, like, pretty blue ones. So 
I was like, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do pink. I didn't say it's the next best thing, but pink is cool. I love my phone case, y'all. So this is gonna be my new phone case. It's clear. This is from Case to Fly, which is a really good case brand. I love it because it has bunnies and bows. If y'all didn't know, bunnies are my favorite animal. And I love bows. Like ever since I was a kid, I love bows. So I was like, I'm gonna get this. It's so cute and girly and feminine. And I feel like that's my new vibe now. Well, spring is coming too, so I just felt like that'd be a real cute vibe for spring. And then I have my new iPad case. Now this one, I don't know if I'm gonna regret getting this one because it was another one that they had that I felt like was more my typical style but this one is just i don't know it just really stuck out to me like i don't know i really like the colors they're really bright and cute so i have picked this one up oh i didn't even tell y'all why well, know we slept the whole time the whole entire class today i was like girl you ain't to the last class to sleep oh this is cute okay so i didn't expect for it to be red i thought it was like more of an orangey coral color but i just love this contrast between the light pink and the red babe this is so cute and what I really like about this case and why I got this specific uh, brand or whatever is that I was going to order an iPad um, stand because when I'm editing, I'd be hurting my neck trying to like look down and stuff. So I was going to order an iPad stand. But this case, you can like flip the iPad around. So basically, you're supposed to be able to like do it like this. So what is this? Horizontally, but also flip it and do it like this. I don't know. But basically, you can flip it around. Okay. So since that rotates, I'm hoping it can be like a two in one and I won't have to order um, an iPad stand. But if I do, I will. She's so cute. Y'all, this is literally the last one that they had on Amazon for my MacBook. So I'm so freaking happy and excited and so cute. So I've been seeing everybody with these little fluffy MacBook cases. And at first I was like, I'm not gonna get me a MacBook case because I just get a sleeve. But I was like, you know what? I want one of the fluffy ones. So I got the pink fluffy one. It is so freaking cute. Like I'm obsessed. And this is like the little back part. So I'm gonna put this on my MacBook. This case is for my old MacBook. I do still have my newer MacBook that's also broken, but I just prefer my older MacBook because it's sleeker. I love the touch bar and I just don't like how heavy my newer MacBook is. So yeah, I'm gonna be putting that on my MacBook. I have to set my MacBook up. I've had it for like two weeks and I still haven't set it up, but yeah. Um, I got a camera case. So this is how it looks. It's like pink. Um, it has a little lens cover, which is great because I be dropping my camera all the freaking time, y'all. And then what else is this? A glass screen protector. Okay. I see y'all because I didn't even know that came with it. Okay. I, I fought with y'all. Y'all gave me a free little screen protector. Next thing that I got was this mic because I think I told y'all that I lost the mic to both of my cameras. So I was like, okay, I need a mic because watching some of my videos back, like you can tell that the mic is missing, especially like if I'm outside or if there's background noise or something. So I was like, yeah, we're going to get another mic. Um, so, oh wow, this shit is huge, bro. Y'all, this mic is huge. It's like huge compared to my other one. Okay, not really what I wanted. This is what I wanted. So I might be sending this back because I really don't need all this stuff. And it's like a wired one and I don't want that. I just wanted the same mic that was on my camera before. I couldn't find like the exact Sony one, but I think this is what I wanted. It's an adapter with a furry windscreen. I think that's what I wanted. So I don't know if this, if I needed a mic, but I just wanted the little thing that helps out like when there's wind and just kind of reduces the background noise. That's what I wanted. I didn't really know what I was buying y'all. Yeah, I'm about to send this stuff back because that thing was like pretty expensive i think and it's a wired microphone and i don't like wired, wired microphones because if they're not plugged in correctly and you record your audio for your video with them then they'll have like staticky in the background and you can't take like you can't like re-record your audio like you could try but it's not gonna be the same okay we got another mic do y'all hear the difference y'all probably do y'all probably do it's cute and it's so fluffy i love when i first get them and it'd be nice and fluffy but yeah i'm gonna send this set back because we don't need it i'm good thank you though car tripod but i don't like there's nothing worth showing y'all Hopefully I can get it installed. I'm only going to put this in my truck because I feel like in my car, my camera stays like on the dashboard a lot easier because it's like a flat surface. But in my truck, my car, I mean, my camera just be sliding. So that's why I needed that. But yeah, so I'm about to put my new cases on. I was going to try and edit, but I don't know if I have time to because I said I was going to start getting ready at 8 o'clock and it's 7.55. So I'm probably fitting and just um, go ahead. I'm going to put the cases on, but I won't actually be able to like edit or anything. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to get ready. So honestly, y'all, this is the end of this video. I really hope that y'all enjoy spending my mornings with with me because i really didn't vlog after the morning time i hope that y'all enjoy spending my mornings with me this last week and waking up at 4 a.m i'm so proud of myself for doing it and i don't know y'all might be like i don't know if today count because i went back to sleep but i woke up at four i just my bed was feeling too comfortable i never get to sleep in so i was like i'm going back to sleep plus i stayed up really late last night so i think it's a win a win is a win a win is a win i don't care what y'all say a win is a win i think it's a win i woke up at four it's not like i didn't wake up at four i woke up at four i just went back to sleep but y'all tell me y'all tell me if y'all think i accomplished it or not. i think i did but yeah I'm really proud of myself for sticking through and waking up at 4 a.m. every morning. I'm even more proud of myself for going to the gym every day this week and being consistent. And, like, I feel so good. Like, that gym is so motivating. Like, the people there, 
hair, their environment, like everything about it is so motivating. So I definitely think I'm gonna be a consistent gym girly now. And I'm just so glad like I really got my life together. Like, I don't know, that's like that girl. Like who you know, waking up at 4 a.m., going to the gym, coming home, getting ready for work, going to work. Like I just feel like I have my life together because I'm waking up early now. And like I've always been like a pretty good morning person. Like I'm not one of those people who wake up and I'm super grumpy or I'm not one of those people who can't like wake up early. I'm like, that's nothing to me. But waking up at 4 a.m. is crazy, but we did it. So I'm big proud of myself. Like I said, working out has been really good for me as well. So yeah, I really hope that y'all enjoy this video and enjoy waking up with me at 4 a.m for a whole entire week i definitely want to keep this going and be consistent with it so y'all hold me to it i do gotta kind of work out some kinks in the schedule and in my routine but but this is definitely something that i want to keep doing so make sure y'all stay tuned so y'all can clock me if i'm not doing it okay but yeah i really hope that y'all enjoy this video thank y'all for motivating me because without this video i would not be holding myself accountable especially this morning if it was not for this video i would have went to sleep and never woke up from my um yoga class so yeah i'm really glad that i woke up oh yeah speaking about my yoga class i gotta do a quick little tad bit about that that yoga class was so good y'all like it was so soothing so relaxing like it just felt so freaking good so i definitely be doing yoga again um but yeah so i really hope that y'all enjoyed this video if so make sure you give you a huge thumbs up do not forget to comment below subscribe to my channel if you're already so you can see my next video thank you so much for watching bye